Hey guys, in this video we are going to fix all kinds of network sharing issues. So if you have any problem with the drives and folders, you are unable to see your network computer, this video is for you. So the very first step, you just need to press Window and R key or you can simply do a right click in the start icon and then click on run. Now once you do that, here we need to type ncpa.cpl, click on OK. And you will see a new window like this network connection and here you need to select your network so since i'm using wi-fi so i'll select this and i'll do a right click and then i'll go to properties now the moment i click on properties i'll get a new window again and here we need to go to this sharing tab and here in sharing you need to select please make sure that it this is selected allow other network user to connect through this computer and then allow other network user to control or disable so both the check marks should be checked and then just click on ok once this is done you just need to do a right click on your folder or driver so let's say if you want to share a folder on a desktop or a drive so you can open like this and just do a right click I'll take my folder here just do a right click and then go to properties and here we will go to sharing tab and then we will select advanced sharing and here we need to select share this folder and once you do that then we need to go to this permissions select everyone and you can allow like this and then click on apply if you only want to give the read permission you can select read only and then click on apply so in this manner you will be able to share this folder and this can be done on a file on a drive external drive or the folder if you have now once this is done we need to enable few services just to ensure all kinds of network sharing issues are fixed so for that we just need to do a right click in the start icon go to run and here we need to type services.msc now once you have typed it, click on OK. Once the services window is open, I'll just maximize it. We need to look for SSDB. So select any of the services, press S and then look for SSDB discovery. Now here in, SS, uh, in SSDB discovery, just do a right click and then go to properties and from here select automatic and then click on apply and OK and then we will move to the next step for that we need to select UPnB so I'll type U and here you will find UPnB device host do the same procedure do a right click go to properties and from here select automatic and then click on apply and OK once this is done there are two more services which we need active and that starts from function so we will press F and then here we have this function discovery provider host do a right click go to properties and from here click on automatic and then click on apply and OK once this is done look for function discovery resource publication so I'll just do a right click quickly and then we need to select automatic and then apply and OK so these are the four essential services which should be running and it should be automatic once this is done you just need to restart the computer then open your explorer file explorer and then go to network once you go to the network you will have all the computers folders whatever you have allowed to the shared network it will be shown here and your issues will be fixed and resolved so let me know if you have fixed your network sharing issues and i hope you have enjoyed this video please hit the like and subscribe and if your computer is running slow at the end of this video you will find a video how to make the pc faster so you can watch that there are thousands of people have got benefited have a great day